The One Year Bible Storybook by Virginia J. Muir. In today's story, Solomon builds God's temple. It comes from 1 Kings chapter 6 and 7. King David had always wanted to build a temple as a permanent house for God, but God said he wanted Solomon to do that, so Solomon was eager to start the work. King Hiram and Tyre offered to help. He cut beautiful cedar and cypress logs in Lebanon and floated them down to Israel on the Mediterranean Sea. Solomon paid him providing food for Haman's workmen. Solomon sent men to help with the logging and also used some men to cut big blocks of stone from quarries. After they had prepared all the materials, the building began. The main part of the temple was 90 feet long, 30 feet wide, and 45 feet high. Because all the stone had been cut the right size at the quarry, the building was put together without the sound of hammers and chisels. The inside of the walls was lined with the cedar boards. Then everything was covered with gold, even the ceiling and the cypress floors were bright gold. Like the tabernacle, the temple had a special inner room called the Most Holy Place. That room was 30 feet square, and everything was covered with pure gold. There the ark was kept, and the gold-colored altar. Beside the ark were two very large carved figures of cherubims. The whole temple was beautiful house for God. The Lord said to Solomon, As long as you obey me and live as you should, I will be here among your people and will never abandon you.